from Pixie Site. I'm going to show you how we can drop videos into your Squarespace website um, and make them so that they autoplay and mute. So I'm just on the Valentina Rose template here. Um, let's just find a section. Let's use this um, section here, which is on the home page. We'll swap out this image for a video that will auto play when someone gets down to that section. So first thing that we're going to do is you may already have your video um, that you want to use. Otherwise, I have just gone to Pixels and I've typed up Field of Flowers. So you're able to do this and of course uh, make sure that it is something that aligns with your brand. Don't just get something random because it's pretty. Um, so let's grab this one here by Taryn Elliott. Um, so you can give people donations on here um, and credit them. So let's jump back into the website here and I've downloaded that video. So we're going to go into edit mode and first of all let's just go ahead and we will delete this image once Squarespace wakes up a little bit. There we go. Cool, so let's just delete that one there. And what we're going to do is we're going to go over to add block and then we are going to go down to find video. So hit video and you'll see the video box jumps in. So we're going to drag that over and always once you're when you're layering things in Squarespace always make sure that it is not layering a blue box over a blue box of text. Um, and then go ahead and check mobile view after you've finished working on the section. Okay, so now that we've got our video block, we're going to go ahead and click on this edit button. And then we're going to simply add our video. So we need to upload our file because we haven't got it in there yet. So there's our video. And as you can see, um, any Squarespace site um, without having to pay extra, straight off you have 30 minutes of um, storage for videos which you're able to use all up. Um, of course if you are a membership site or you have lots of how-to videos on your website um, then you may need to upgrade so that you can have more video on there. Cool, so you can see that our video is now in there. So what you're able to do is you can toggle that on if you would like to upload a custom featured image which is what will sit there before the video plays um, or if you do not have on autoplay then someone needs to go and hit play so first of all they will see that image so I'm going to keep that off I'm going to mute the video so that there's no sound I'm going to turn on autoplay um, so that it will just automatically start playing and I'm going to also loop the video. Um, so this means that once it gets to the end, then it's going to just repeat. Um, player controls, so this is if you're wanting to show the play pause button. I usually like to have these as none as well. Um, and we are done. So as you see with videos, they will hold their um, ratio. Um, with the video so that it doesn't distort the video. Now there is a way to use a piece of um, code and masking so that we can fill that area. Um, I have that in my templates so that we can actually fill the whole whole box size. But otherwise that is how you get video onto your um, Squarespace website. So if we go ahead and save that and then we can jump in and look at the site um, in full screen. You will see that once you scroll down, the video is just automatically playing um, and it will play on loop as it's doing right now. Cool, so that is just saved. I'm going to make this full screen, scroll down. And there you go. We can see that our video is automatically playing. Um, as I say, always go ahead and click on mobile view um, so that you can check in how that video is sitting on the site. That looks all good. If we were wanting to um, layer it with 
on top of this one here like it is on desktop then just make sure that you go into edit mode you can drag that up um, and it is not going to affect how it looks on desktop so if we're moving it in here or even changing the size it's not going to change um, how it is on desktop cool. always make sure that you go ahead and push save Thank you.